I'm talking with Jerry Lee Lewis, who's sitting right here. It's amazing. Thank you very much. Great balls of fire. Thank you, Dick. Great balls of fire, a whole lot of shaking going on. Yeah, yeah. Can you remember the words to Great Balls of Fire? That was always a favorite of mine. You shake my nerves and you rattle my brain. Can you remember any of the words? <laughs> Very sexy song. What came after that? Too much loving drives a, st a man insane. Yeah, and then what? You broke my will, but what a thrill. Yeah. Goodness gracious, honey. Great balls of fire. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's pure poetry. When you, uh... That's right. When you were, when that you were... That song is. Oh, yeah. When I you didn't were, write it, though. Otis Blackwell did. Yeah, giving credit where it's due. When you were uh, at the... <laughs> writing the crest of the rock and roll wave and all of that, did you realize that there were people who actually thought that rock and roll was a communist plot to undermine the morals of America? I never thought that much about it. They yeah. cared less. Yeah? You mean, you mean you might have been part of a communist plot and you don't care? Well, if my music, uh, the way I sang it and play the piano and do it, if it's a part of a communist plot, mm -hmm. I'd have to be communist, I guess. Yeah. And I'm not communist. I'm an old Louisiana boy from Fairy Day, Louisiana. Yeah. Mean as hell. How do I know you're telling the truth? <laughs> but uh, oh, there really were, you know, there were people who said this is. I'll disagree uh, with him and see what happened. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, there were people who said this is. Uh, I'm you know, this I'm well, not, I, you're an old Louisiana boy. Old Louisiana boy. That's from right. bio country. I understand you married a girl from uh, Greenwood, uh, Mississippi. I did. <laughs> oh yes, yes, I did. Yes. Thought I'd throw that in. Yeah. You know that area of the country too. Right. You've probably you've probably played every uh, every place in the South by this time. My boy, I have played every three-two beer joint. Yeah. Every nightclub in the world. Every hall that has ever been built and torn down. Some that haven't even been uh, constructed yet. Did and you ever appear in Ramcat Alley? Yeah, several times. You're kidding. Oh Lord, yeah. Played them all. No kidding. Bloody bucket. Well, that's a nice place. <laughs> no, seriously speaking, yeah. uh, Dick, uh, it's a great pleasure to uh, to be on your show. I think you have a fantastic show. Oh, uh, follow the rock. You. When, See how I can con my way in. That's right. Hey, did you ever lose your I'm voice? Watching and it, you. you know. I, <laughs> I don't care. I'm joking. I don't care. Lose That's my right. voice. I mean, I don't. I, yeah. When, when, Are you when rock and roll started, a throat doctor said to me, "Not one of these stars is going to last more than six months because they're going to grow. Uh, you know, they're going to irritate their larynx so badly that well, they're I all going to be out of business." I grew. Did it happen to you? No. Did you have a throat problem? No, I only grew in stature. No, I, I, I mean, I didn't finish that sentence. That they were going to grow things on their, you know, the, when the edges of the vocal cords rubs together, it causes a sort of corn on there. And well, this... I'm, not, I'm not a doctor. I don't know. It never happened to me. I've been screaming, hollering, staying up all night, listening to records, raving, drinking, cutting up, loving women. Great balls of fire. Yeah? 16 years now. What do you do to relax? <laughs> <laughs> never mind. The old lady. Mercy. Yeah. Say, yodel. Can you teach me to yodel? Yes, sir. That's about the last thing in the world I want to learn. But I. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll tell you what. I've just wondered if there's a trick to Country it, music, or to changing uh, octaves like that. I, you know, I, I love to listen to yodeling. I used to hear Texas Mary Mihalovich on the radio. Excuse me. Oh yes. <laughs> Country music, rock music, blues music, started from the old blue yodeler Jimmy Rogers who was born in Meridian, Mississippi. And this is the That's king that started it. Is that right, fellas? He said so. You're yeah. damn right it's right. It, it is. And, and I said so. It. And if you don't think it's right, check it out, brother. No, I believe him. You hey, challenge him to a fight. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, he, yeah. didn't, he didn't hang in too good on me and Bobby McGee that while ago. He wasn't keeping up with me. They, my, my band didn't keep up with you? Drummer. The drummer didn't? 
The reason why I said that because he said what he said. Man, he's a great drummer, though. I hate to say that. I know. know. You were here. You were complimenting him during the break, and now <laughs> in the air. He's fantastic. I'll yeah. tell you what. This is the greatest band I've heard in, in many years. Thank you. Drummer. Yeah. Yeah. I was just cutting you up. Had, like you were cutting up. Right. You had no rehearsal, did you? Yeah. Walk right in, straight up, off the street. Yeah. We, we didn't even know you were going to be on that. You were just walking I by. I didn't either. <laughs> <laughs> you and Chuck Berry are going to be working together. Uh, that's right, Dick. Who is Chuck Berry? Well, I think Chuck Berry, uh, to me, uh, would be uh, a man like, uh, well, you could take Hank Williams, Yeah. the way he writes songs, or go back to Jimmy Rogers, the old blue yodeler who wrote a lot of songs. And, and, uh, uh, he wrote rock and roll songs in the era of rock and roll. Uh, I think Chuck Berry is one of the greatest songwriters in the world, one of the greatest rock and roll singers I've ever heard in my life. There's no doubt about it. Yeah. And one of the greatest showmen. I knew who he was. I was just putting you on. I was you just... ain't putting me on. I mean... Well, taking you off then, whatever it no, is. No, don't take me off. I won't, ta I won't take you off. Would you... In fact, I'll put hey, you really on. really rocking in Boston. Far out. We'll be, will you do another number? Okay, we'll be right back after this message of interest.